Hey guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to the Sims 3 Into the Future LP. Um, before I get into this part, I just want to say thank you, one, for all the love and support on this um on this LP. It's it's fun. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for that. And my second thing is um thank you guys for like correcting me on the words um that I mispronounce. I know a lot of you guys don't mean it in a rude way, and some people try to make it seem you guys are saying it in a rude way. Um, but you guys, thank you for that. Uh, it does mean a lot to me. Uh, I wouldn't say English is my number one subject, you know what I mean? Um, I'm just not familiar with a lot of words. Uh, English hasn't been my greatest subject. Um, so yeah, sorry about that. I'll be working on it. I'll try my hardest and uh, we'll see where that goes. But thank you guys for that. It, it does mean a lot to me and thank you. <laughs> so yeah, let's get into the game. Um, in the last part, we made it Utopia. <laughs> Utopia. <laughs> Hopefully I'm saying that right. Um, anyways, yeah, I'm not really familiar with these words. Like I've never, I don't know heard of them. Anyways, when we left off, Lily was here in the future watching some TV. Um, I think Cody just got off of work. Yeah, he just got off of work and he was going to go sleep. And Brandy was just uh, going to work, actually. Um, so I think I'm going to have Lily go get a Simbot in this part. Let's see. We need to go, even though it's like not really, oh my gosh, that rainbow. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This town, honestly, what in the world? They did an awesome job with things like that. Like the landscaping, just everything about stuff. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like they did a really good job. Also, if I sound like a little down, I've been sick actually since the day that Island Paradise has released. Um,. I just saw something crossing like this water. I don't know what that was. Oh, it's right here. No? Yep. I was like, what is that in the water? I know, there was definitely something in the water. Okay. Um, I don't know if I want to have her go get it or one of our other Sims in here go get it. But she's the only one who's ready to actually get up and go out for the day. So I think I'm going to have her go make a Simbot if that's even possible. Um, by the way, this is my first time ever experiencing any of this. Anything you see in this game is my first time seeing it, first time looking at it. So I am pretty unfamiliar with a lot of the things. So I hope you guys bear with me. It's kind of like my first impression on, ev well, not my impression, but my first glance at everything. Um, so I've never really got to know any of the features yet. Um, so I'm pretty sure what we're supposed to do is go, I know we need to get trait chips, which is why I kind of want to go find, um, a plum bot so I can steal it because I know you can steal them. But, oh, a lot of you guys were telling me to check out the diner and how adorable the diner was. Um. So, you can have a do fight? What? We don't even have two on us. That's crazy. Um, okay, so here is a couple of plum bots, and, uh, oh my gosh, this is what a lot of you guys told me to come check out, is, uh, the people behind here, or something, how they have cute little bow ties. A lot of people told me, go check it out, it's so cool. So let's take a little look-see. This one doesn't have one. But, I don't know. There might be some around here. I think they're pretty cool. Oh my gosh! We can uh, we can shake these little plants right here. We're definitely going to have to do that. And what are these in the water? Oh, they're like little flowers li on little lily pads. Super cute. Oh, look at this plum bot. She is so cool. Oh my gosh. We're going to have to come over here and adjust her trait chips. Maybe steal a few. Or one or how many I don't know how can how many can we get I know that we can steal them 
but I have a feeling that they're going to hate me after stealing them, but it's okay. She's like, who are you? But okay. I'm going to let you do it to me. Um, so she has a handy bot, a component, competent cleaner, and robotity gen, gen <laughs> gardener. I, I really can't talk. Um, I want this one. Can take them all. Oh yeah. Um, unfortunately, some of the trait chips were destroyed in the process. Um, yeah, we probably shouldn't have Lily be getting these, considering she can't do anything. Oh, this poor, oh, she just lost, um, her name's Dot. Dot just, like, lost everything. Oh, that sucks. And we didn't even get anything out of it. That sucks. That's awesome. Let's collect some dew from it. awesome is that we got um a few bottles of dew cool it's really cool so i think we're gonna wait till brandy gets out uh of work to actually get one but let's go ahead and uh order some drinks maybe is this like the only part of the diner well this isn't a diner this is like a little stop and grab i guess but i'm Where's the diner? I'm kind of curious to know, you know, what the diner looks like in here. Over here, the bistro. This is, I think, what people were talking about, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I think it's where we are that they were talking about. Oh, I don't even know where she is. Oh, she's at the gallery. Gallery. <laughs> right now. Um, what else do they have here? I kind of want to buy something. Um... To bring back home with us that we don't have at home. A lot of you guys told me to grab those computers, which I will do when we head back to the present. But for now, I'm waiting for Brandy to get out of work. So I think I'm going to go ahead and skip until Brandy gets out of work. Until we go and get a plum bot. So I'll see you guys then. Actually, um, I'm going to have Lily go head to a lounge and um, see if there's any cute guys <laughs> or girls. So let's head there. It's called the, I, I don't remember, the, or tough. <laughs> I'm winging it, I'm winging it. All right. Okay, let's see what we have in here. Is there anything new? A new pool table, that looks pretty cool. Um, hmm. It's really pretty. It's really really pretty I must admit I I do like that how pretty it is um it's really really unique and uh, yeah I, I do like that about everything but there's like no people here I mean it is 1 p.m. <laughs> so I wouldn't really expect too many people to be here but we're gonna come here to the legacy park and try to meet some civilians here in the future I'm kind of curious to you know meet some of them uh, what do we have over here mm. we have this little chunky monkey Ezra Brown oh uh, he has the same last name as Cody actually in elite oh okay true right right on and this is Eileen Brantley um, I'm assuming they're dating because <laughs> oh my gosh Okay, so these are like the um, statues, actually, that we uh, could possibly get. Those are really cool, actually. Let's see what else we have around here. Here's Emmett, uh, what's his name again? Emmett Velavart, which is actually a uh, time traveler backwards. Um, just thought I'd let you guys know that. A lot of you guys told me about that. I'm like, that's really cool. Woo! Oh, look at this guy holding up a simoleon. Cute. All right, let's uh, come over here. She's actually talking to that chick. She's like, okay. Um, yeah, totally, 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 totally. <laughs> We're totally interrupting, like, their date or whatever. I think they just woohooed on here, too, on this lot or somewhere around here. Or everybody's just really happy in this world. Yeah, that's what it seems. Seems like everybody in this, um 
form of the future it just walks really happily this is like the more positive perfect society I think that's what it is cuz look at this it I'm really really impressed with kind of how they made everybody in this world really happy like look at this sim right here giving this sim some flowers and they're really happy oh no actually declined I don't know it seems really cool but Brandy's gonna head here and uh, adjust uh, these trait chips Lily's over here talking to Eileen maybe she'll be our first friend from the future oh he sucks it hurts no descendants that you know well enough are home. Ask to stay over at descendants home. <gasps> this is actually one of our descendants. Oh my gosh. So we definitely have to come friends with her. We're going to make a silly face. Um, share wisdom. <laughs> show funny video. Show gross video. Show internet cat video. Tell funny story. Um, high five her. And yeah, we'll do that for now. All right, so Brandy's over here adjusting the traits. We're gonna try to get these. I don't know if we can without destroying them, but um, doesn't look like we got them. Of course we didn't. I think we need to improve our our skills. So uh, let's uh go back to the Simbot Emporium and try to get that up. While Lily talks to her descendant. Okay. This is what I think is really cool. Let me show you guys this about the the new computers or yeah, I'm pretty sure these are the new computers. Yep, it is. See this little ball thing. Uh, they pop up in front of you, and you can pretty much uh play it like that. Be on your little computer like this. It's really neat. Here's a little plum bot actually doing it, which is really cool. Um, but yeah, we're gonna have Brandy go to the plum bot emporium. And we're going to try to get uh, some skills while we're there. Do, 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 All right. Plum. It's the, called the Plum Bot Building Skill. And I'm not quite sure how I do this. I don't know if I read it out of a book or if I study it here. Like I told you guys. I'm a complete noob when it comes uh, to this because I I'm completely completely new to this um, I think we come here and design nanites no, you guys corrected me on this you guys corrected me on this I think I said that wrong let's see let me let me see okay it's nanites and I am so sorry for what I, I don't even nanite wait man nanites right I don't know <sighs> Whatever. Bear with me. Me and my poor, poor, poor little mind. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna try to uh, try to do this. It's really neat if you really look at it. Also, I had my sound muted accidentally. Um, we need to keep working on that, girl. Keep going. Yep. This is how you get up your bot building skill, which is kind of cool. It's easy too. All right, create a plum bot. I'm sure you want to. Oh, which one to get rid of? Talk about Cosmos. Um, let's see. Create a plum bot for 250 simoleons, which is super cheap. Wow. Okay, that's easy enough. We're gonna enter create a plum bot and uh, get a little plum bot. I'm really excited. Um, I think I want to make a little, a little girl, not a little girl, but a little female plum bot. Um, so let's see, we're going to name her, mm. hmm, I think I want to name her Cosma. I like that. And, yep. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, her head. Let's see what we have in here. Uh, let's give her kind of like this one right here. Where was it? It was like a big square, kind of. 
<laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> I love it though. Oh, where was it? I don't think this was it. No. I don't know. Okay, that one is terrifying. Oh my gosh. I think I want to give her this, the little ponytail. Yes. Yes. Let's give her the little ponytail. And where is a... Uh, give her a really cute... Uh, let's make it... That piece purple. Yeah. And uh, her... I like that. That's really cool. I like how this looks. Okay. Uh, let's give her a little body, a little body. Uh, this one, Ooh. maybe. Mm, this one, Ooh. make her a little chicky, right? Let's, uh, let's do this real quick. And let's give her some legs, I, I guess. Oh, actually, these are arms. Cool. I think I want her to have just little arms. I think that's what I want. Maybe these arms. These ones are kind of cool. Yeah, those ones are neat. And let's give her some legs. Maybe, maybe I want a, um, a hover. Some hover legs. Um, I think a hover leg would be really cute with like the little skirt. Like that. Or do I want legs? Hmm, the struggle. Do I want legs or do I want to team too thick? No, <laughs> that was ratchet. Um, but we're going to give her no legs. Um, I don't know. I just want her to be really, really girly and cute. So this is Cosma. Um, this is our first Plumbot. And I think she's really cute. She's really girly. And I like that. I like girls. <laughs> so yeah, let's watch that Cosma be created. She's like, where am I? What is life? Oh, she's super cute. Okay, scan. Equipped a trait clip. Or not clip. Yeah, chip. Not clip. I make too many videos. Uh, uh, let's design some trait chips and uh, see what we can get out of it. Before we go messing around with Cosma. She's designing those chips. But we're going to come over here to her. Let's see. What is she doing? Inspecting Plumbot. Uh, an angular. Angular trip. Angular chip. And um, Brandy can now build Plumbots. These robotic companions are just like a member of your family. Only shinier. Installing trait chips will help the Plumbot develop their personality, skills, and unique abilities. Um... You can pretty much morph your Plumbot into anything that you want, um, which is really cool. So, let's, I think we're going to leave Cosma the way she is for now, and we're going to have her go head to the station, our home base, and I'm going to have Brandy do the same thing, and I think since Cody goes to work in five hours and is totally ready to wake up. I'm going to have him uh, come here and uh, start working on his bot building skill and maybe make some traits as well. But for now, Brandy needs to go home, get some rest, and maybe tomorrow after work she will go take Cosma out. But for now, they need sleep. Yeah, let's uh, bring them up here go to bed. Oh, look at this bedroom. Oh, I love this. I love it so much. Okay. All right. This is where, okay. Well, actually, crap. Brandy, you and Lily sleep at the same time, so you guys can share that bed right there. Ian Cosma, go in there as well. Cody, you were going in the right place. I accidentally exited out, though. Let's have Cody go over there now and go do that. Also, um, let me know when you guys want to have Cody and Brandy get married. Like, where? There's another question. Where should we get married? Um, 
should we I'm thinking we should get married in this futuristic form because I think it's really pretty and I think it could create such a beautiful wedding if you ask me if we did it here so yeah let me know but I think we can have Cosma um power down and charge just like this and I think that's how she charges She's pretty much like a regular person. Yep, her battery power is uh, raising. She's pretty much like a regular person. Uh, so, social. Install the friendly function, sense of humor, and all that stuff, and you'll get social. Uh, fun. Install the... Um, oops. The sentience. Um, I got a text message. Hold on, let me check that. Who is this? Sexually kick. Um, chip for fun. I get so many texts when I'm filming, to be honest. Um, equipped a simulated emotions trait. Chip. We'll, we'll do that. We just have to work on it. So, Cody, are you over here working on that? Or are you just gonna wander around? Uh, keep working on it. He's going to design some trait chips for now and see what we can get out of there. The carpool for Cody will arrive in one hour. Okay. Alrighty. So, I guess Cody's just going to go get ready for work and I will see you guys in the morning. Alrighty, so Brandy's awake and she's going to go upstairs and get some food, I think. Oh, uh, what is she doing? She's actually showering. Oh, and she's going to shower in the new shower. <laughs> so let's take a look at that. It's uh, it's the futuristic shower, so I'm excited to see this. What? 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 Oh, what? I'm so confused. Ooh, we can change it to colors. Sick. Let's do it to Aqua. Oh, I love that. That is too cool. We need one of those for the the house back home for sure. Um, for sure. Also, when we go back home, I'm gonna get them some jobs for present time. I actually think Cody's gonna be a little, a little uh firefighter while he's at home, and when he comes here, he's a little plum bot, you know, cleaner upper and stuff. I think that's so cute. And, um, Lily, I don't know what she's going to do. She's probably going to work part-time at, um, the spa. And Brandy will probably be in the science, um, career. So that's probably what's going to happen. Actually, I think Brandy just took a do. A do. Brandy just took a do. Yep, she's pinkified. Exposure to do leaves Brandy glowing a tropical shade of pink. She feels right at home among flamingos. So, yeah, she's pink right now, and I think that's super cute. Also, a lot of you guys informed me these little um, mysterious fragment thingies are actually keys to the, um, the wreck. Also, a lot of you guys were telling me back here that this was actually, and it makes so much sense now, a houseboat. It makes sense right here was the beach. There's a little houseboat. <laughs> so I think that's really cool. Thanks, guys, for that. I think this is um, a houseboat as well. Really, really cool. But yeah, here is the crash uh, site right here. So we're going to see if we can visit that with Brandy and maybe try to get in that. I Oh, we have to go find more. All right, just kidding. We have to be able to put the mysterious fragments together. Uh, we're missing one, two, and we have part... We have two mysterious fragment three, and we are missing the other one. So we're going to come here and check it out, see if we can find all the parts for that. Travel to the present. We will be doing that. She wants to enter the crashed uh, ship. Yep. Uh, she found another mysterious three. We don't need that. Oh, my gosh. She's supposed to be at work. <gasps> Never mind. Oh. Ah! You're missing work. Oh. Alrighty, guys. Uh, just kidding. Pfft, that's for the next part. I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Um, sorry if I'm a little dazed and confused in this part. I'm just a little, I'm a little kooky. 
Um, it's kind of late for me, and I'm just, you know, I don't feel too good, but whatever. I will see you guys tomorrow with another part of Into the Future, and I love you guys, and I will see you guys next time. So, until then, I love you guys. I don't know what else to say. Bye, guys.